and you can do a masala. Now, my ex-girlfriend was obsessed with this thing you get in Leicester. Anyone from Leicester here? An amazing place. You're from Leicester? It's a great place. The first majority minority place in the UK. Brexit hater. Um, okay, some Brexit voters in. Any Brexiteers here? Really? Happy with, uh, happy with your vote? You'll see how it goes. A bit late for that, sweetheart, isn't it? You've lost Scotland. Scotland's gone. I think Yorkshire might come with us. That's what I'm hoping for. We can do with a centralised railway system. Um, so, I was slick. We rehearsed that earlier. Um, uh, the thing about Pania. It has no flavour. You need to add flavour. If you kept the same fucking tempo, I could do this. I really could. Um, it is very much a texture. Um, and what it... It's a little bit like... Um, similar to aubergine in a way. Which is... Reminds you of that story when George Orwell was up in the Hebrides writing the wee bothy. You know what a bothy is? Right. You know what a bothy is? A bothy is where you would drive your sheep to market in like the overnight with a communal house. See in the dictionary under socialism when we used to share things? <laughs> Life was happier and simpler and the rubbish in the streets and the strikes. Um, this house was so communal, you'd stay in it, you'd fill the the woods, the basket for the fire, you'd clean it down, and then somebody else would come this day with you, you'd do a shared space, then you'd leave it as you found it. Um, so he was up in a bothy writing, and a piper in the next field started playing the pipes, the bagpipe. And I love the pipes, but if you're not into them, they cut through you like a dose of salts. And Orwell crosses two fields, stands in front of the piper, waits for the piper to finish, and he says, you will let me know if this other typewriter puts you off your piping. And it pulls away. It's one of my favourite Orwell stories. So if you're into the texture of paneer, you need to add the flavours. That's what you bring to the party. Um, but I, 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 you can't have paneer, can you? Vegan. Should we just save a little bit of masala for the vegan? You don't have a name anymore. You know that you're just known as a vegan. 